If you stay in the fold, you still represent, you still gotta throw up a four one time. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let my daughter, that's my oldest daughter right here, Tennessee. This legacy, they gonna do their thing. Y'all ready, gang? Let's get it, buddy. They ready? Yeah, yeah. Dress it up and make it real for me. What's up? Hands up, one time, one time. Yeah. Whatever that fucking man. Wireless. Tell us who you got with you. These my beautiful daughters, Genesis and Legacy. Beautiful. Hey, ladies. Y'all doing all right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So for off the stage, we're going to ask some random questions. Mm -hmm. Mainly one. So today we're doing a little game called Would You Rather. Okay. All right. Here we go. So I've spun the wheel. Would you rather yell a swear word between every word? Or get punched in the face after every swear word. A yellow swear word. You you rather yell a swear word? You because nobody want to get punched in the face. Nah nah, I can't take that. I can't even talk. I can't even take people talking to me too loud. So I know I ain't gonna take a punch in the face. You an introvert? So I don't. You know what? I feel you. I'm an extrovert of introvert. I'm only outside when I need to be. Any other time, I'd rather be in the house with a big shirt on watching Netflix. Yeah, chilling. Exactly. I came a homebody myself. Really? Yeah. What what made you become a homebody? Were you one before COVID? Oh uh, well, actually, I was working out through COVID. I had opened my store, so I was working out through COVID. So you know, now just it just really kind of grow for a lot of things go on into our environment and our community clubs and different stuff. So I try to set a platform for my daughters and have them a part of everything I'm doing. So you know, you do your business and get on out the way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's great advice because, you know, I tell a lot of people, like, I'm a DJ, and I say, don't always rely on DJing to pay all your bills. Right. You got to have something to fall back on, and it seems like that's what you're teaching right. your children. Absolutely. 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 So you guys like the legacy that your daddy is leaving for you? For sure. What's the biggest thing you guys love the most about your dad? Everything. Oh, yeah, very much, sweetheart. His dedication. He keep us pushing. That's what I'm talking about. You know what? It's always good to hear your children yeah. be able to you for you to be here to be able to hear your kids say those things about you. Get those things out of them. You know what I'm saying? So be able to hear is always. I'm always thankful for that. For sure. Exactly. I just said I have a 15 year old and a five year old, yeah. so I understand. Drop your socials for us. Oh well, my social is three times for life underscore. That's the number three times spell times. For life, F A L I F E underscore. Give me your Instagram. Give us your Instagram, sweetheart. It's your girl dot Genesis. It's your girl underscore legacy. There we go, guys. All stage. Number three. He said four up. Hey. Salute. Salute, four man. Mayor of the city. Y'all already see. I see you, Charlotte, North Carolina native. What you doing, Vibe Trade? We you ain't number four. That the president got on country club number four. You never been. Tracks, you ain't never been to the sugar shack. I was at the back end of the Cadillac. A lot of people got killed in the physical. Huh. I'm a real North Carolina nigga. Might take it here on a cruise. A fool, a fool. Huh. My name ain't Dennis, but yeah, I am that dude. Huh. What you know about me? Yeah, they showed me the most love. I used to stand up for the sewer story, post up. And then go to stage right after the player club. 